front of me is a Samsung Galaxy M53 and today I'll show you how we can record screen on this phone. So to get started you want to pull down your notification panel, expand it and locate your screen recording toggle which for me is right over here. Now when doing this the first time around you could also hold the toggle. This will quickly take you to the settings where you can check out how the device actually like will be recording the video, what's the settings of the video recording. So right here we have the screen recorder and we have sound, we have media sound which is just what the phone will make, not the microphone. Then we have video quality which is set to uh, high which is good. And then below that we have a selfie video size. And this right here is the actual size that you will see also on the screen if you enable this feature uh, which you can do while recording. And below that we have show tops and touches which will just show a semi-transparent gray dot on the video recording uh, to indicate where you are pressing the display. So uh, if you're planning to record gameplays I would not turn that on, it would just look a little bit distracting. Uh, if you're planning to record some, I don't know, informa informational video like I am as an example, this might be actually a good thing to have enabled. But anyway, once you went through the settings right here, you can close this and you don't have to come back here ever again, assuming you don't want to change some settings. And whenever you want to record, simply tap on the toggle. It gives us an option right here if we want to record again what kind of sounds. And again, we have the toggle for the tops and touches, which I will again keep off. And from here, select start recording, you can skip the countdown and it is now recording. So everything I'll do right now will be recorded by the device, any kind of application. You can also add this uh, camera as you can see. You can draw on the screen. You can pause the recording. Uh, the pausing of the recording might be useful, for instance, if you're trying to log into some kind of application and you need to sign in, you can pause that video sign in and then resume once you have done so. It will well, allow you to hide your personal information like passwords if you don't want to disclose that to someone, obviously. Now once you're done recording you can tap on this uh, square right here. This will automatically save your recording to your gallery application. So let's open it up. It will also create another album in your albums tab called screen recordings where you can quickly find that recording and every other one that you have captured over the time. So there we go. That is the screen recording. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.